tayo ng masaral Sa mas walang maiiwan At sayang mag-aral tayo ng mas tuto Upang di kayo masenso Maging matyaga, maging matalino Hindi na mataral na tayo Magandang araw mga bata! I am Teacher Joe, your lecturer for today. Handa na ba kayong matuto? Let's go! Our topic for today is solving routine and non-routine problems involving the volume of a rectangular prism. At the end of the lesson, you must be able to solve routine and non-routine problems involving the volume of a rectangular prism. Before that, let's review some words that we have studied in our previous lesson. Volume is the amount of space any three-dimensional figure occupies and it is measured in cubic unit. Rectangular prism is a solid figure that has 6 faces, 12 edges, and 8 vertices. Vertex is the corner of the shape. Edge is the segment where two faces of a prism meet. Some rectangular prisms have faces that are shaped like rectangles and squares. That is the edge of a rectangular prism. The face and the vertex. Last time, we studied how to find the volume of a rectangular prism. What is the formula in finding the volume of a rectangular prism? V equals L times W times H. Wherein V is the volume, L is the length, W is the width, H is the height. Problem number one. Alma has a shoebox whose length is 13 centimeters, height is 8 centimeters, and width is 4 centimeters. Find the volume of the box. To analyze and solve the problem, you can do these steps. First, understand the problem. Know what is asked in the problem. And in this problem, we are looking for the volume of the box. Next, find the necessary information. And the given facts are, length is 13 centimeters, height is 8 centimeters, and the width is 4 centimeters. Next is plan what to do. Determine the operation to be used. Yes, we are going to use multiplication. What is the number sentence? 13 centimeters times 4 centimeters times 8 centimeters equals N. Let's solve for the answer. We are going to use the 
formula in finding the volume of a rectangular prism, which is V equals L times W times H. V equals 13 times 4 times 8. And the answer is 416 cubic centimeter. Check and look back. Yes, the volume of the box is 416 cubic centimeter. Let's have sample problem number two. The width, height, and the volume of a rectangular prism are 6 centimeters, 4 centimeters, and 192 cubic centimeters respectively. Find the length of the prism. To analyze and solve the problem, you can do these steps. First, understand the problem. What is us in the problem? Yes, the length of the prism. In this problem, volume is already given and what is missing is the length of the prism. Find the necessary information. The given facts are width is 6 cm, height is 4 cm, and the volume is 192 cubic centimeters. Next, plan what to do. We have to determine the operation to be used. Yes, we are going to use multiplication and division in this problem. What is the number sentence? 192 divided by 6 times 4 equals n. Let's solve for the answer. Since we are looking for the length of the rectangular prism, we are going to use this formula. L equals B divided by W times H. L equals 192 divided by 6 times 4. L equals 192 divided by 24. And the answer is 8 centimeters. Check and look back. Yes, the length of the rectangular prism is 8 centimeters. Here are some of the problems that we are going to answer. Are you ready, kids? Here is the problem. A carton of juice, 6 cm long, 5 cm wide, and 20 cm tall. What is the volume of the carton? What is asked in the problem? Yes, the correct answer is the volume of the carton. What are the given facts? You are correct. The given facts are 16 cm long, 5 cm wide, and 20 cm tall. What operations or processes were used to solve the problem? Perfect! The answer is multiplication.
What is the correct mathematical sentence of the problem? You are correct. The answer is V equals 16 centimeters times 5 centimeters times 20 centimeters. What is the volume of the carton? Perfect! The answer is 1,600 cubic centimeters. You are doing great, kids! Let's have another problem. A rectangular pole is 35 meters long and 10 meters wide. What is the volume of the water in the pool if the depth of water is 6 meters? What is asked in the problem? You are correct. The answer is the volume of the pool. What are the given facts? You are right! The given facts are 35 meters, 10 meters, and 6 meters. What is the operation to be used? That's great! Multiplication is the operation to be used. What is the answer? <laughs> Perfect! The volume of the rectangular pool is 2,100 cubic meters. You are doing great, kids! have another problem. A cube is a rectangular prism with the same measurement for length, width, and height. If the cube is 7 inches tall, what is its volume? What is asked in the problem? That's correct. The volume of the cube. What are the given facts? Perfect! The given fact is 7 inches. What is the operation to be used? <laughs> you are right! Multiplication is the operation to be used. And what is the answer? Three, two, one. Perfect! The volume of the cube is 343 cubic <laughs> inches. Great job, kids! Remember this, kids. To solve word problems, we follow the four-step plan. First, understand the problem. Second, plan what to do. Third, solve. And the last one, check and look back. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned something today. Once again, I am Teacher Joe saying, keep safe and have a nice day.